Hello everybody and welcome back to Gromforks Place Planet Crafter And we have created a new base, we have planted some seed, we have died due to the lack of food And this time I'm not gonna let anything bad happen to me I like myself way too much to do so Now, I think I'm gonna go down this route to see and explore is there anything else we could do Now, just a quick test can I craft myself a backup living? Yes, I can. Good. And I can refill myself. Good. Never travel without your portable homesteading kit because you might end up and dying horrible death. Yeah. Okay. Consuming some space food. And there is a box, which is great. And it has some more eggplants. Well, you know what? I was considering them trash before, but to me, it's like treasure now. So I really think... I need them, to be perfectly honest. And I think we're gonna be recycling soon enough. Because we're gonna need the recycling machine, honestly. Now let's just quickly see where is that... There is another container. And that's the container in the sulfur flats. Oh, there's two containers. Oh. So wheat. And there's a microchip. And I have nothing to put... Down at this moment I should be putting down one titanium picking up the chip yes okay there's another chip hold on where's the titanium I just dropped yep inventory full okay tell you what I'm gonna do I'm gonna be dropping the fabric because fabric I don't need that much at the moment but mushroom seeds they seem highly useful and there is another space food, so might as well eat it. Okay, perfect. Good. O2 is low, meaning I should really construct my capsule here. And ultimately, this should be a place for a third base, I think, because this is a very good location for building a base. What about here? Oh, we have more chips. We have some more... Relea seeds, we have some more space food, that's not a bad idea. And there's a crate all the way at the back. Tell me there's something good in here. Yeah, okay, whatever. Okay, uh, at least titanium, I would need silicon and stuff to make one more of... Um, I could leave a base site here, so that's not a terrible idea. If I can, can I construct this? I'm missing one. I haven't won too much of iron. So what should I be leaving here? Maybe iridium? That's not that uncommon. And let's take one more of iron. So I actually am going to construct my base like here. And I need one more iron for the living compartment. Yeah, it was going to have one hell of a view. Just tell me that there is one more iron here. Yes, there is. Okay, perfect. So I can create this thing. And what do you need? Iron and cobalt for the view. Iron and cobalt. Do I have iron and cobalt? Iron, cobalt. I have. Great. I need to have a beautiful view. Sorry, guys. There we go. Look at that. We're, this episode will be like base building 202. Okay, so sulfur we have now. Now, what can I take from here? I could take Nulna seed. Yes, I could take Iridium because I need it for more heating. That we know. I'm going to take more Iridium. Uh, and I'm going to take another water bottle. You never know. Okay, Balea 250, 200. I already have 200. I'm not even using the ones that I currently have. So honestly, I'd rather, much rather take two water because... No, actually, one water. Leave it here. I have enough. Okay. I'm going to pick up that last titanium bit. What is this? Sulfur. Inventory is full. Oh, and I shouldn't have a full inventory because I need my portable refinery. Okay, that means titanium should be left. I should leave... Hold on. Um, uh, this is getting so confusing. I should be leaving Nulna seed. Two titanium. Iron. Uh, I'm leaving again Nulna seed. Two iron. 
and I and I just need I think I need three iron I need three iron I think yeah okay tell you what I'm gonna do I'm gonna be leaving iridium again or seeds maybe no seeds 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 I'm gonna be leaving Jesus I hate being indecisive okay I'm gonna leave seed okay so I need three iron three iron two titanium and one silicone I think one silicone yes so is this now everything I need to create additional living compartment let's check let's test it yes good okay and I have one more here or two more here you never know when you're gonna need you're gonna need a spare compartment so that's fair now I'm just gonna go quickly in refill and then I'm gonna go back all the way yeah I know you can tell me you know ground forks you dumb you know blah blah whatever I've died too many times and I'm not sure what's the best course of action so I'm actually trying to be careful here I'm trying to do the responsible thing yeah see there's another thing that I has had built is there any food here no see useless mm. okie doke that means that we can go now all the way back now at least we know that there is an alternate route all the way around what I haven't found is aluminium in its natural form and that actually scares me a little bit because if there's no aluminium in its natural form that means we're gonna have to recycle a lot and we're gonna have to invest a lot of time doing that stuff which is a downer uh, but understandable so so yeah hopefully we should be able to go all the way around and uh, it's a good thing that I have these uh, small bases littered around because that gives me a greater freedom of movement. Now, oh, okay, nothing of note. Now, this exploration is actually quite fun. I'm actually enjoying Planet Crafter. I don't know about you guys, but uh, I think Planet Crafter is actually a very fun game. Oh, I have this in container, super alloy and this. Could I replace something with super alloy? Magnesium, probably. Super alloy. And one more iridium or one more aluminium. I'd replace almost fabric with aluminium, yes. Because fabric is not that important, while aluminium is actually very important. Okay, so that one could be destroyed by explosives. That's where we saw all the ores. All right, and look at this. I mean, the bio biomass terraforming index is actually quite higher than I have originally left it, which is definitely a plus. I have my water bottle. Anything of note here? Not really. Then we are getting to our tier one construction, and I'm almost thinking I should disassemble it for a tier two construction because tier two will obviously bring in more benefits while still retaining the same rare materials oh food space food okay that's mighty helpful but at this moment i'm actually well i should just make a mental note that here there is some space food remaining going to that ship was a big mistake really big mistake i actually just died there for no apparent reason whatsoever okay here's our old base look how cute it is and it's working at the peak efficiency okay so let's see blueprints decode a microchip shredder machine whatever that is okay what else do we have area lamp that might be useful big living compartment yes please okay so now I want to be going back to my new base and let's just see is there anything here worthy of a pickup oxygen bottle always worthy of the pickup eggplant seeds worthy of a pickup i'd say don't you think guys and here yeah cobalt silicone iron whatever now 
let's go back to our main base and see what the next object next objectives are because honestly at this point i have no clue I would like to drink some water and there is definitely some ice and you can see that the area has looks a little bit different the icy surface have melted the skies are bluer and uh, maybe soon enough uh, we were gonna get starting to get rain and all that jazz I mean the landscape has definitely changed and that's a good thing so let's see how there's another crate here our water is getting dangerously low. I mean, I do have a water bottle. Yes, okay. And I know where some of the ice is, so I will be able to eventually go and pick it up. Okay, let's just grab some oxygen. And when it comes to it, I should have some aluminium. Thank you. Honestly, seriously, thank you. Now, I should be able to craft a tier 2 crafter. I need a 1 magnesium for that. Okay, 1 magnesium. Did I pick up all the ores? And there's like, nah, regular ores. Magnesium, there you have it. Plenty of. Okay, rare ores. Super product. Now, magnesium. There we go. So, I should be constructing tier 2 something somewhere. Maybe here, can I construct living compartment here in addition and there have a big producer. I mean, my cupboards are not going to be too happy about it, obviously, but I can come forward and there we go. There's my tier two crafter. Oh, and it went down. Okay. Tier four backpack, tier four oxygen tank super alloys uranium and iridium rods jetpack rocket engine okay now how much am i short for power and there's my food oh water i'm missing water almost died there open food grower eggplant seeds can i pick up an eggplant yes i can apparently there's an eggplant restores health 25. I should create more food growers, but hold on. How much do I need? I need at least a tier 2 solar panel. Can I produce a tier 2 solar panel? I should be able to. Magnesium, silver, cobalt. I think I saw one aluminium over here. Everything is so quiet. Spooky almost. I have this magnesium iron all right fair enough fair enough don't panic this is doable silicone and two cobalt silicone and two cobalt silicone and two no no not to magnesium two cobalt okay so that should give us another solar panel which should be in theory fixing the power crisis over here where is the tier two solar panel yeah there we go So, power restored, you don't say, aha, so, ah, so this is how you get rare materials, okay, and I did get a lot of rare ores over there, so when it comes to rare ores, I might take two uraninite, which should be breaking down into okay that actually explains a lot but if i want to create the bigger one i need three bauxite cobalt dolomite and i need one more solar panel so i'm gonna need to be breaking down oxide how much bauxite do i have how much can i risk i have three so two of them i could risk okay i'm gonna then risk two bauxite i don't like the idea but it is what it is all right you start chugging along sun and we're hopefully gonna be able i need some aluminium to produce things so if i'm producing this one i'll need i'll need aluminium i need food grow i need two aluminium water bottles i need to go get ice oh wait i think i had some ice here where the seeds are 
yes, I have ice. So I'm going to produce four water bottles. Two, three, four. Okay, now I have four water bottles and I want to be constructing the food grower, but I need aluminium and then I'm going to be planting a bit more. Hopefully that should be enough to keep me alive. Come on! How long do you need? Okay, let's check the status of everything. Now, we have uncovered on the terraformation, we have uncovered advanced crafting. So hold on. Advanced craft. Next one is the launch platform. Ah, it's coming soon. Blueprint printing. Oxygen is grass spreader and flower pot. Grows grass outside, generates biomass. That's huge, but it requires a lot of energy. This one also requires sufficient amount of energy and it produces heat and pressure. That's good. Tier three drill. Uh, I, do I have eight spare energy create one I do I do so it creates a pressure pressure would unlock these and heat heat would unlock biodome algae pressure pressure should be done more so yeah I need a drill so how do I construct a drill what do I need to construct a drill What's this? Shredder machine destroys item placed inside. I don't need that. But I do need the... Okay, I need titanium aluminium. Uh, I think I'm gonna stick with the iron and titanium ones. Iron and titanium. Iron, titanium. Two iron, one titanium. Let's see if I can create two more tier two pressure makers hopefully they would pressure makers tier two i can always deconstruct them and get my materials back so no harm no foul but they will at least accelerate things hopefully did you decompose thank you finally okay now food growers we need to construct them pronto before I forget. Food grower 2. Oh, come on. You're going to be putting these. Is there a way I could create... Uh, I have another aluminium, but they want to use it for the food grower. So, how much does the food grower consume? 15? Shoot. Okay, I need then definitely one more. So, one silicone to cobalt. One silicone to cobalt. Uh, I thought, and I was naively thought, on silicone to cobalt. One silicone to cobalt. Another solar panel. Oh my god. And I thought that I'm gonna get away with just the solar panels. That's ridiculous. Okay. There we go. Power restored. I really need the nuclear reactors. How do when do they unlock? By pressure, of course, at 60. Oh boy. I mean, once we create that, that will allow us a lot more different things to be grown and it will actually work quite fine. However, we really need to go get there. Uh, grass spreader. What can I do? If, if I could, I could make a grass. I need Lirma seeds. I know that much. And that one consumes a lot right that one consumes energy 13 do i have 13 at the moment 1255 oh that's ridiculous so in theory if i created one more solar panel it should work okay let's create one more solar panel screw it two cobalt one silicone two cobalt I mean, I have this material that's sitting here doing nothing, so might as well create one tier one solar panel. Why not? Yeah. Like this. Okay, how's that for a change? So, do I have now? And I have 19. Good. 19 should be enough. 
Now, this one should be enough for us to be able to aluminium layer mass seed generates biomass. Aluminium layer mass seed. So what's the next? Uh, I mean, next stage is clouds, and we're almost there. So that's good. We're doing a lot of terraformation. Oxygen is rising, heat is good, pressure is good. Terraformation, we're golden wise. I would really like how much we have. 19. And if I wanted to create another food grower, that I need one more aluminium. But if I go with this, this one is taking 21 and this one is taking two. Oh, I don't have the power for it. Two cobalt, one silicon. Let's do it again. Two cobalt, one silicon. Who cares? Two cobalt, one silicon, and some iron. Okay, let's place another one. I really want to be making this tier two thingy. How much energy do we have now? It's sort of my goal before the end of this. 25. And the, that one needs 21, which means I have enough. Good. So now I need three bauxite, two cobalt, and dolomite. Three bauxite, two cobalt, dolomite, three bauxite, and now I need two cobalt. Okay, we're doing this, guys. Now. Okay, so... So what's the difference between the tier 2 and the tier 1 crusher? I'm sorry, I'm just curious. Maybe it goes faster? Insert ores to break them apart. I guess so. This one maybe does it faster? I don't know. Or try. Let's try and get two of those, see what the, see where they land. If worst case, we're gonna have two, so who cares? Okay. However, now we're producing some more advanced ma ma materials. Okay, I can eat an eggplant, and that's good. And this mushroom has been growing quite quickly, so we have two, that's nice. I think I'm gonna need one more somewhere. Maybe here. Can you fit a food grower here? I hope so, because if I can... Collect your stuff. There we go. Okay, I'm placing it here. Now, food grower, you need to be fitting in here. You do. Perfect. Shit! Now what? I mean, seriously, though. I just wanted another freaking eggplant. Okay, can I create something more? Uh, I think I have one more aluminium. Hold on. If I have one more aluminium, which I do, what else do I need? Magnesium, silicone, two cobalt. Magnesium, silicone, two cobalt. Magnesium, silicone, and two cobalt. Magnesium, silicone, and two cobalt. Magnesium, silicone, and I'm actually going to replace one tier 1 for a tier 2. That's what I'll do. Yeah. Now, I'm going to get the tier 2, and that should solve our power problems. See? Power restored. Good. Okay, now I need magnesium, cobalt, and everything else. But, I think we're quite close consumption-wise, so we have another eggplant. Good. We cannot collect this yet, and we cannot collect this guy yet, but we are good. I'm going to consume my water bottle, and soon enough we will be able to create the nuclear, I hope, 60. Yeah, pressure is building up, so everything is looking quite better at the moment. Well, and we have our two constructors. Well, I guess, guys, you know what that means. As always, like if you like the episode, hit subscribe, and I'm going to see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. This is Groundforks, signing off.